We are on a mission of helping people to make more informed financial decisions. That's the heart of our company. With the financial crisis of 2008 brought to light the conflicts and injustices inherent in the financial system, few people come up with real-world practical solutions that would actually make a difference for individuals and families. In September 2010, Poverty in America increased to nearly 15% of the population. This means that in less than a year, over 4 million people moved from the middle class into poverty. The poor and middle class. Most people work 52 weeks a year, 500 months of their life, 41.6 years average. Most are taxed up to 51.2% of their income. Most are overworked, struggle, live paycheck to paycheck, have little time working on things they cannot own or pass on to their children. The average 50-year-old in America has less than $2,500 saved. So let's say you go to work when you are 25. Most people go to work much earlier than that, but I will keep the math easy for you. You went to work at 25 and you are now 50 years old. In 25 years, you have been able to save only $2,500? $100 a year is the best you can do? $8.33 a month is all you could manage to put away? The fairy tale is over. Once upon a time, all a person had to do was go to school, get a job, work hard, and retire. Until a few years ago, the company you worked for took care of you when you retired. You received a paycheck and medical benefits for life. Today, this is a fairy tale. Once upon a time, all a person had to do was buy a house and the house went up in value. Homeowners got rich in their sleep. Many people could sell their homes, some even pocketing a small fortune to sustain retirement, downsize to a smaller house, and live happily ever after. Today, this is a fairy tale. Once upon a time, the United States was the richest country in the world. Today, this is a fairy tale. Once upon a time, the U.S. dollar was as good as gold. Today, this is a fairy tale. Once upon a time, all a person had to do was go to college, and they were virtually assured of earning more money than those who did not graduate from college today. This is a fairy tale. Schools are about job security rather than financial freedom, which is why most employees live in fear of losing their jobs. Schools teach little or nothing about money, which is why millions of people now believe in entitlement programs like Social Security and Medicare in the United States and millions take jobs in government or military service not to serve the country, but for retirement and medical benefits. Social trends changing our world. More hours required to make a living. Median income is declining. Less benefits. Less perks at work. Layoffs. Downsizing standard of practice. More mothers working outside the home. More stress in the workplace and at home. Less time for family, friends, and recreation. Less savings for college expenses and retirement. Dream takes longer to achieve. Which trends are affecting you the most? Retire in style? Unlikely in a traditional job. Reports published several years ago indicate what you can expect if you follow the 45-year plan. On average, for every 100 people who follow the traditional job or career path to age 65, 29 die before reaching age 65. 13 earn less than 5200 per year. 55 earn between 5200 and 33000 per year. 3% earn more than 33000 per year. Even though today's earnings may be slightly higher, the fact remains that 97% of people have no financial security at retirement. Most are dead, dead broke, or living on a severely limited fixed income. 
If a person knows the tax laws, they will not pay unnecessary taxes. If they understand the banking system, they will not save money. Rather than call their home an asset, they will know that it's a liability. If they understand inflation, they will not try to live below their means. Rather than get out of debt, they will learn how to use debt to gain wealth. And they will not mindlessly turn their money over to Wall Street bankers and financial planners and real estate agents in the hope of obtaining a secure retirement. Can you imagine how different your decisions would be if you have tomorrow's information today? Get back with the person that sent you this video for more information.